YouTube, it's your girl Nicole back with another video and for the title down below, as you guys can already tell, I will be doing a little cooking video today. So, right here I have some boneless chicken thigh in the crock pot and we about to go ahead and season it up, you know, get it all nice and seasoned. So for the seasoning, we have garlic powder, we have some adobo, and we have some sazon total, it's like seasoned, and then we have a packet of sazon, um, I like to add a little bit of tomato sauce. To thicken up the the um the sauce and then inside of here i know you guys see an ice cream box an ice cream thing but inside of here we keep the sofrito so yeah we just about to start adding the seasoning I know I spilled that there, but I'm going to clean it up. And I'm going to add one more. Not so much. So I just got done doing the chicken. I added some carrot and some red pepper off camera. So now I'm going to put the top on it. And we are just going to wait three to four hours. Right now it's 10.53. So like by two, so like by one or two, it should be done. So I'll get back to you guys whenever that get done so we can start on the rice. So far, this is how the chicken is looking. I put some carrots. This is going to be good. The chicken is getting soft in there. You see, it's already like breaking apart. So it's getting soft. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna just lower the fire, the, the heat. I'm gonna lower it. All right, guys. So I'm back, 
and now we are going to get started on the rice so today i will be doing rice with corn so first thing i'm gonna do um i'm gonna turn this on and i put it on high now i'm gonna go and i'm gonna get, put some oil So this is the oil that I use. I use the um, canola oil. And you wanna put, not as much. You wanna put a decent amount. Right here I have the corn that I use. I use this one. It's already open because I had used it earlier. You want to pour it in there, the whole thing. All right, so now I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to put some tomato sauce just to thicken it up. Adobo. The um, sazon total. garlic powder salt you can use any salt if you don't like this one a pack of sazon and the sofrito that we keep in here I'm gonna do two spoons. Well, maybe three because this spoon is little. Yeah, that should be good. Now you wanna mix it around so that it won't get burnt. And then I'm going to add two and a half of water. Right here I have the rice. And we use like a little um, cup like this. A mug. So two. One. And then two. And then the same cup, I'm going to fill it up two times and then half. So right here I added the two cups. And then I have the half in this one. So now you want to just mix around. And of course, you want to taste it to see if you need to add any more seasoning, you know, to make sure if it's good. Perfect. So now, I'm going to let it sit until it starts getting dry. It's going to start bubbling up and it's going to dry out all the water. All right, so now I'm going to turn it. And you also, when you do this, you want to lower down the fire. On like, right now I have it on four. You want to lower it because if not, then your rice will get burnt. Once you put the top, you want to um, check it once in a while and keep on turning it 
for they won't get burnt so i will get back to you guys when the food is get done all right guys so i just got done eating it was amazing the flu the flu it was amazing the food um i hope you guys like this little cooking video with me and if you did make sure you like comment and subscribe and yeah leave any other type of videos you guys would love to see from me and i will do them and yeah now i'm here sitting down chilling with my dog but um yeah i love you guys and i will see you guys in the next one bye